greetings once again welcome to my yet another youtube video grade 11 math lead grade 11 grade 12 math lead i mean today we'll be calculating the volume of a drum so on the question alongside we're also we're only going to concentrate on question 4.2 that contained nine marks. If you look at this question, it says that the following diagram shows a drum that is advertised as 200 liters. Answer the questions below. We are given the diameter, which is the distance from this point to this point of the drum, which is the distance from what? circumference to another circumference or from circumference to circumference then we also have the height which is the distance from the base up to the top of the the drum <coughs> sorry and then the dimension that are given here we have given the diameter as 580 millimeters we have the height as 93 centimeters and again we have we are given the equation i told you before that every time when they give you the equation to say that you may use the following equation they are actually telling you to use that equation so if you are if you are asked if you are asked to calculate the volume you are going to use this equation to say volume of a drum is equal to pi multiplied by radius multiplied by radius multiplied by height where pi is equal to 3,142. And again, the additional information that we have here is 1,000 centimeter cube is equal to 1 liter. So it's fine. Let's look at the first question for 5 marks. 4.2.1. It says that show with necessary calculation that the volume of a drum in liters is different than the advertised liters determine so with necessary calculation that the volume of a drum is the diff, the volume of the drum in liters is different from the advertised 200 liters okay it's fine it means that we should calculate the volume of this drum so how do you calculate the volume of a drum? I told you that whenever you are asked to calculate the volume of this drum, we are going to use that equation. Let's copy down the equation. We know that is the volume of drum is equal to pi multiplied by radius, multiplied by radius, multiplied by height so let's write the given information uh, let's write the given information so that we'll be able to substitute here pi is given as 3 comma 142 radius we know that radius is going to be what A diameter divided by 2 we have a diameter. A diameter is given as 580 millimeter. We're just going to say 580 millimeter divided by 2. We are calculating a radius now. So you just have to say 5, 580 divided by 2 is equal to 290. The answer is 290 millimeters. Not to forget, in metrolite we cannot work with different units. So because the height is given in centimeters and the diameter is given in millimeters, even our radius is in millimeters, so we rather convert uh, radius to be in centimeters we just divide this by 10 therefore our radius is going to be what 
29 centimeter. We divide that 290 by 10 to get 29 centimeter. And again, we are given the height as 93 centimeter. So all this information are given. So what you need to do now is to substitute the given information at a relevant equation whereby we already know that our equation is pi multiplied by radius multiplied by radius multiplied by height which will say that pi is equal to 3,142 multiplied by radius what is our radius 29 multiplied by radius again 29 multiplied by height 93 is equal to you take a calculator just gonna say three comma one four two multiply by twenty nine multiply by twenty nine multiply by ninety three the answer is two four five seven four five comma two four six meter centimeter cube centimeter cube that is our answer <coughs> sorry but the question here said we must calculate the volume in liters so we are now going to use the relationship that is given to have one liter is equal to 1000 centimeter cube that's the relationship that is given now we have the left hand side of this and the right hand side of this so what do you need to do at the left hand side we are writing the centimeter cube and our previous answer is centimeter cube you just write it here to have two four five seven four five comma two four six centimeter cube the other side the left hand side we represent x because we want to convert everything to right to liters we cancel the centimeter cube so that we don't get confused then from there you do the cross multiplication to say x multiplied by 1000 you say 1000 x is equal to one liter multiplied by two four five seven four five comma two four six the answer is two four five seven four five comma two four six liters then we divide everything by one thousand divide everything by one thousand this and this cancel x is equal to take this amount divided by 1000 you find the answer that we get is 245,745246 liters which is approximately to 245,70 five liters if we are to run off to two decimal places so the question is uh, with necessary calculation the volume of the drum in liters is different than the advertised so obviously when we do the calculation we find that the volume of this drum is equal to 245 and 75 liters but in the advertisement, it's written that this drum is having a volume of 200 liters. Next question, 4,2,2. Now they want us to explain why the two volumes are different. Why the two volumes are different. It's very easy. Same apply 
to a Coca-Cola bottle. When you go to the shop, it's written maybe 1,25 liter. 1,25 liters. But don't forget that 1,25 liters, it is, where, it is not when the Coca-Cola bottle is full. When we buy the cold drinks, they are not full to eat capacity. There is a space that is left. It's to say that if we are to calculate the volume of that bottle, we are going to get something greater than that. But because at the shop, when they sell things, they don't fill them to their full capacity. That is the reason why when we calculate and advertise things, they are not the same. So how are you going to write that? When answering the exam question, you can say that the volume of advertise refer to the maximum the capacity or the drum can hold. The volume of advertised The volume of the advertisement refers to the maximum the drum can hold. This drum can hold 200, 200 liters. But we as people, when we buy it, we are going to fill it to eat full capacity. Hence, when we calculate, we find that it can hold 245 and 75. But at shop there, they only consider up to where they can fill it. Questions? Let them follow me on the comment section. I'll get back to you. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to share this video with your friend. Thank you.